so hi hello everyone welcome to the channel and today I will show you edge detection algorithm in Google Earth Engine so let's get started so what is an edge detection algorithm in remote sensing usually in an image we could like to identify some objects that are having a huge unique uh, edge and features so for example we might want to extract buildings roads and other features that have an uh, unique edge so from a uh, satellite imagery so you can manually uh, do that using uh, digitizing for that specific features but in remote sensing in remote sensing we have an advantage of writing a script to detect the edges of that particular features so doing that we can automatically apply and we can uh, get the edges or the required edges automatically from an uh, imagery so now let us perform an edge detection using our Landsat 8 uh, collection 1 tire 1 top of the atmosphere so to perform an edge detection first let us define our study area so let us perform define our study area using a point using a point to define a study area using a point I have defined a variable called I have defined a variable called point it equals to double dot image uh, geometry dot point and the, it is our coordinates so this is our coordinates the latitude and longitude information so you can also change this coordinate according to your wish uh, you can also change the study area by providing the latitude and longitude of your choosing of your interested study area so next is uh, we are going to compute a buffer of a polygon so from the point we are going to create a buffer of 10 kilometers so this represents 10,000 meters so that is equal to 10 kilometers so we are going to generate a buffer of 10 kilometers around the point that is our study area so we have particularly generated this buffer so in order to extract the information from our satellite image so that is to extract all the information within this buffer we are going to define as our uh, our buffer as our second study area so first we are choosing our point data and after that we are computing a buffer of 10 kilometers and from the 10 kilometers we are going to extract the all the edges edge informations so next is uh, we are going to uh, load a Landsat 8 image into Google Earth Engine so to load a Landsat 8 image so to load a Landsat 8 image into Google Earth Engine I have defined a variable called image equals to double e dot image collection so it is referring to a particular image so there is a Landsat Landsat 8 collection 1 tire 1 top of the atmosphere with a specific date of 2016 and February 9 so to perform our edge detection uh, we're going to define a, so we define a Laplacian or the edge, de edge detection kernel so to perform an edge detection kernel I have defined a variable called Laplacian equals to w dot kernel dot Laplacian 8 and normalize false so this is a specific algorithm to generate our edge detection so this is our uh, this is our algorithm to perform the edge detection so next is we are going to apply the edge detection kernel so next is we are going to apply our edge detection kernel now let me reset this So to apply an edge detection kernel, we define a variable edge image equals to image. So this image referred to our Landsat 8 image. We defined a variable called image that refers to that Landsat 8 image. And we're going to perform an algorithm of convol, the convol, and uh, referring to Laplacian. So this is the this is our the edge detection kernel. So to perform an edge detection, we define a variable Laplacian w dot kernel Laplacian. So to perform the edge detection and to apply the edge detection, we are using variable edge image. We define a variable edge image, edge 
image equals to image refers to our Landsat 8 image Convol convolve convolute and laplacian and laplacian refers to our variable so this variable that is our kernel uh, edge detection kernel so to add this layer we have defined map dot add layer edge image dot clip so edge image that refers to this so refers to this one that is our the edge detection kernel applying edge detection kernel and clip by our study area that is region so we define our region is our buffer a buffer of 10 kilometers and bands we have defined the bands band 5 band 4 and band 3 with the maximum value of 0 0.5 and minimum of 0 and next is to in order to us to center our uh, center our layer and to our study area with a particular zoom level of 12 so I defined map dot center object region zoom level of 12 so now uh, let us run this code go to this option called run script click run script so this is our edge detection kernel the result we obtained from our Landsat 8 image so now we can able to view the different edge features so you can able to see that this is a this red color red line so here this particular road this is a road network so that is detected as a, a red color let me uh, zoom out so now you can able to view that this is our road red color and similarly so similarly let me show you that so here we have a other feature so let me uh, turn this layer off so now you can able to view that this is an aircraft that is our uh, so that is our airport so this is an uh, airport so our lay edge detection algorithm has performed uh, so performed and it is indicated so you can able to view that so this is our uh, the runway of uh, runway of an airport and similarly there is another network of this line let me uh, so you can able to see that this is our road layer so our kernel uh, edge detection has uh, identified this road so you can able to view that so this is a road and uh, other another feature is uh, it is there is a river that is running here you can able to view that this is a base map and uh, there is a river running so i will turn on this layer so now I can able to clearly view that the reverse the river network so there is several features that can be identified from our uh, edge detection kernel so there are several features that is uh, we, we can identify from our edge detection so this is the 30 meter resolution now uh, we have chosen only 30 meter resolution bands with higher resolution uh, satellite image we can uh, detect our edge more uh, that is more accurately and uh, can uh, yes we can detect uh, our edge more accurately so in this video i have shown you how to load a point data and how to how to compute a buffer and how to load our satellite image that is our landsat 8 image and to perform our edge, de edge detection uh, kernel and to output our layers so thanks for watching, please subscribe to our channel.